All right, guys. Welcome to a brand new episode of Atria Creators. I'm Arab, and we are just going to watch the review of Android OS in my Redmi Note 10. So, without further wasting our time, let's keep rocking. So, if you can see this, this is running on Android 12. It is not currently running on Android 12 L, but soon it will support because it is in beta form, so it doesn't support. After they seeing that the Android security update is fifth May. No issues with that. Also, kernel version is Legion X and this two is used. Otherwise, if you see that, there is nothing more things were given. It is the first beta one update. If you go to system, there is the option of gestures to tap and you can select what you want. If you not, not want notification, just click on two times here and you get a notification panel. Quickly open to camera is there gesture navigation. From here, you can see this immersive navigation. You, you can see this the navigation gets hided. So there is no options of that also. After seeing that, you can also disable it. But I can only see that if you want to use that, you can also use that also. So 100 mode is also there. It is working fine as you can see this. Sometimes it doesn't work, but it works all the time. Playback control you can enable from here. How much quick torch is also there. How much time you want the want the and it, uh, the torch gets opened so screen of gestures is there what do you want why double tap if i double tap here the uh, torch gets opened so it totally depends on you what do you want and what do you doesn't want and after seeing that all of the things there is option of the rules you can use that also nothing more new is that up in the battery options you can see the battery usage I already got about 10 to 11 hours of SOT in this device. So there is nothing issues with that also. You can also enable show battery percentage. You can see that there is an option and it gets enabled help you out. Default launcher you do get Panadroid launcher. From here you can customize this launcher. It doesn't come with more customizations. Game space is there. You can enable game space from here and you can add this applications in there also in the i already told you about the battery for the next thing display you get nothing in the display icon manager you can enable which is here you, if you change that it gets changed nothing new about this color saturated natural what you want you can just enable from here nothing new is given to this after seeing all the things you can see the wallpaper and style you can arrange which type of content you do want theme icon or non themed icon if you like the themed icon you can change from here and i don't like the normal icons because we already have many years passed away with having the normal icons and yeah some apps don't support the themed icon because it is in beta update google will soon push an update to this so they can get fixed after seeing that all the things i will share you the screenshots what i have just searched out and it is the first CPU throttling test. I have run six times, six minutes fifty six seconds. And if you can see the result, it starts dropping because the battery is very low. As you can see, this battery is too much down. And after my charging goes, I will also share that screenshot. It is the storage speed test, and you can see this. It performs well, twenty one thousand one hundred three. And it is the Antutu score 2,79,980, approx 2,80,000. You get a GPU 43,496, which is better. And uh, here is a 6 degree up in temperature and 3% drop in battery. So there is nothing issues with that. And after the my gets uh, device gets about more than 50% of charging, no CPU thermal throttling detected as you can see this. And the max is the 146,621 GIPS and the minimum is 133. 718 GIPS and after running that it is the single course is 512 and the multi core is 1413 nothing more much bigger scores but yeah average it is my mobile data speed test as you see I am getting 20.50 MB within my area I generally got 15 to 16 but sometimes it, it gets and it is a 2.4 year speed test it gets 53.67 Mbps and it is my 5 gigahertz speed test i have a line of 150 mbps so you can see this 155.82 mbps is there it is the netflix 
playback specification if you see wide one l1 security level is here system id is here and the playback resolution is full hd is supported and here is nothing to see more about if you go you get a google camera beta version and here you can see this the new kind of ui with the material u you can see this you can but it doesn't work performs pretty well you can use the google camera port in your device easily after seeing all the things yes this roms do support camera to api so there is no issues with that safety net is but defaults passed easily and if you ask me for the safety net sorry device certification device is do certified i am currently telling you that it is in beta update version but it will soon support a re basic release in this rom so thanks for watching my videos if you don't like subscribe please like subscribe our channel so till then thanks and do like subscribe to our channel bye bye